Alrighty, so I just wanna make this very, very clear on what the, re the election results are. So, as you can see, officially, Joe Biden is now the president elect of the United States of America. Donald Trump right now is still president, but he will no longer be president by January 20th, 2021. So, along with that, Trump's been tweeting all day and, pos and possibly all week that he continues to claim he won time and time again when we all know the real truth behind it that Joe Biden has 75 million votes and Trump only had 214 so about 70 million votes. In in this case, Trump did not win this election. America decided that it was going to be Joe Biden, and it is. 71,000 legal votes in most ever for a sitting president. Uh huh, yeah. It's actually not a lot. As you can see, Joe Biden has 75 million more votes than you. The servers who were not allowed in counting rooms. I won the election. Got 71 million legal votes. Bad things never happened before. Millions of mail in ballots were sent to people who never asked for them. Don't make this false claim, Donald Trump. I won this election by a lot. Don't make this false claim. We all know who really won. It's Joe Biden all along. Why can't you just accept it and move on? Like, seriously. Do you have to be a fucking sword loser? Like you already are right now? Just accept it. Joe Biden wins. And you didn't. You're going to cope so hard that you will one day lose your account. And I heard that because Twitter said so. Twitter says that after January 20th, 2021, you're going to lose your account. I just don't understand how you can just make these claims that you want when you haven't. You don't like to accept the reality. I get it. But... You're a human being. You're supposed to be supported. And yet, we, we all know who you really are now. You are not. You're a mean person. You've always been, been mean. And now you're a person who never wants to accept defeat? Why can't you accept defeat like a normal human being? Why are you being a bad sportsman right now? The people who you claim never asked them are the people who served in the military who actually did want them 
to come overseas so that they can vote when they're not around America yet. Which won't happen until Thanksgiving. That's how it works. Keep making these false claims on Twitter. Like, what do you gain from that, Donald Trump? What the fuck do you gain from doing this? You are literally asking your own account to get Turnery someday. And it's going to happen. Every tweet I'm going to check on you is literally going to be turn me within the matter of the next 390 days. Or at least the next 70 days. The next 70 to 80 days. Your account will be turn me. Because, again, you're doing this. This will also change the election results in the states, in Pennsylvania, and blah blah blah. Yep. How much of a solar loser do you have to be now? I can't wait for you to actually be dragged dragged out of the White House because the longer you tweet the longer you're gonna realize that you will face reality for what it is you're gonna face reality for as the way it is This is just extremely delusional that you will not concede the election. Not even your henchmen. I mean, Dan Borongino, he's completely stupid. Polls were more wrong in 2020 than in 2016. No, they weren't. The polls are more, are more right, and you know that. You are a disgrace, Dan. I know how you get to work alongside Trump. Or as a conservative in general, if you can't accept that these are the ways that Americans, that Americans like me, can have the right to vote. And when we vote, it is final. It is final when the votes are counted. There is no need to keep hiding anything. You're done. Trump is done. And his associates are done. You will never claim victory. You are a loser. And you always will be one. Accept it. Move on. Or else.